What is the maximum baby weight for a normal vaginal delivery? Hello, and welcome to our discussion on baby weight and vaginal deliveries. One common question that expecting mothers often ask is, what is the maximum baby weight for a normal vaginal delivery? Today, we will explore this topic and provide some clear, concise answers to this important question. What factors determine the method of delivery? Before we jump into specific numbers, it's essential to understand that the method of delivery, whether it's vaginal or via a C-section, is influenced by several factors. These can include the baby's size, the mother's health, the baby's position, and the progress of labor. Even if a baby is large, a vaginal delivery may still be possible if all other conditions are favorable. What is considered a large baby? A baby is generally considered large, a condition known as macrosomia, if they weigh more than 8 pounds, 13 ounces, or 4,000 grams, at birth. However, this is a rough estimate and the definition can vary. What is the maximum baby weight for a normal vaginal delivery? Now, to the heart of the matter. While there isn't a universal, maximum, weight for a baby to be delivered vaginally, babies weighing more than 9 pounds, 15 ounces, or 4,500 grams, are at a greater risk for complications. This may lead healthcare providers to consider a C-section. However, this decision is not solely based on weight. As mentioned earlier, many factors influence this decision and it is ultimately made in the best interest of both the mother and the baby. What are the risks associated with delivering a large baby? Delivering a large baby vaginally can increase the risk of certain complications. These may include prolonged labor, damage to the birth canal, a higher likelihood of a C-section, and increased risk of injury to the baby during birth. It is crucial to discuss these risks with your healthcare provider when deciding on the best method of delivery. In conclusion, while there isn't a strict maximum weight for a baby to be delivered vaginally, it's generally agreed that babies over 9 pounds, 15 ounces may pose additional risks. Remember, the decision about the delivery method is a complex one that depends on many factors, not just the baby's weight. Always consult with your healthcare provider to make the best decision for both you and your baby. Thank you for joining us in this discussion, and we hope this information has been useful to you.